let's continue along the quest line. Signal booster. Triangulate. Now let's, we need um, these. What are these called? Um, they will upgrade your exosuit. You need carbon nanotubes, tent sodium nitrate, and antimatter housing. So nanotubes, antimatter housing. Okay, and uh, I will add, upgrade the exosuit with a cargo spot. Observatories sometimes reveal the locations of crashed ships, um, but you'll have to enter the next in a code sequence. So you see here 1702. If you move the 7 to the left and the 1 around, you get 7021. If you move the 7 around, you get 0217. So you must move the 0 around to make 2170. what let's do that it gave us the destination usually I think there's about three of these knowledge stones Grab the words, use the knowledge stones. Okay, I just see two here. You can use F to look for them. They look like these narrow things with the circles inside. of an ancient civilization was once absorbed by the strange marker. The story of the Vikings somehow spills out in the language of my own people. The noble travelers will be spared. Their journey through the cosmos shall not be thwarted, so it is decreed. The will of her commands it. The Vikings shall honor the judgment and the belief of the ancients. So, of course, I believe one God created everything. Let's do knowledge of the past so we can make some uh, some money. Artifact fragments, artifact fragment, artifact. I'd ignore the gravitino ball if you don't um, 
Sometimes when you grab those, it triggers the sentence. You'll need three keys. You'll need to get three of them. Now you look for the main container, which is not an artifact fragment, once you get three keys. They are large artifacts. Place the three keys that you got. All right, it may not have given you the item. You may have to go over there and use these. Fresh pond foot cuttings. Approximately 790 years old. A powerful medicinal herb. This plant could hold the key to developing the cure for the common cold should be deposited at a responsible cloning unit immediately. If the value is half a million, not bad. These, these natural burial sites are more valuable generally. Let's go let's go to the natural burial site. Those tend to be more valuable or as valuable. We'll see what we get. Bizarre skeleton excavated bones, approximately 2,993 years old. A manufactured artifact adorned this magnificent skeleton in death. Was this once an intelligent life form, a beloved pet? The bones alone are inconclusive, but this is nonetheless a remarkable find. The value is one million two hundred and sixty one thousand six hundred and ninety six units. Okay, we're at five and a half million. Not bad. Um, you could speak to these aliens to get the location of a grave. Answer them however makes sense. Then go back and speak to him again. And offer the 100 nanite option. You should have at least a hundred nanites on you. And he gives me directions to what's called a unknown grave. We'll go to that. Ask 
a question no one had asked. It was simple. The Sentinels. What are the scents? Do they come from? You know, what are the Sentinels? Where do they come from? Made it my life's work to find find out where the Sentinels came from. Left logs, records across worlds, and the fallen traveler's grave is marked by a glyph. All right, we extract it. Okay, we get a glyph, and we get this memory fragment. When you do E to consume it, you get a random, I think a random item. This is 50% extra resources mine. That's pretty good. You know what? This is supercharged. Let's see what this does, Supercharged. 88% resources. I'll, I'll take that. By the way, um, if you want to see, go to the catalog. Go to the collected knowledge. Go to the atlas. Go to portal glyphs. And you see I have the first glyph. Alright, let's answer the communicator. Do X, F. All right, he wants me to go to a hollow terminus. So you see the scan. Yeah, there's spoilers in my videos, but I guess you could say a little bit at a time. Now we get a free diagram um, blueprint for the, for the translator. I just need a microprocessor. And if you don't have 100 copper, uh, you'll need to mine copper. Journey milestone accomplished. Fluent learn 20 words. Such little honor, Viking are unimpressed. So I need to improve my reputation. Need to improve my standing by two. Let's start by talking to people. First dialect. <laughs> Practice language. And 
there's one right there, one of two. And there's the second one. All done. Class twenty six million. I ask about the star system. Copy the life. I give him the star chart. If you ask if he made a mistake, you'll get a minus with them. Just thank and leave. Let's use this. The appearance modifier. First, our ship is red and gray. That might be interesting. Let's do red and gray. right now. Alright, let's try this. And 
there's our ship. line search for ghost in the machine locate and activate a hollow terminus let's try C now the base quest. I, I think it's a good idea to do. I greet him. I'd say I'm a friend of Artemis. I ask why. This exchange almost seems childish to me. I say Artemis is in trouble. He wants my data. I upload the log. You want to work with him to get the expanding the base quest. Agree with him. Oh, well, you could suggest life is worth more than money. I accept. And communication. Or perhaps it was nothing, a ghost in the machine. Okay. We will begin to work on the expanding... on expanding the base that's locating Apollo's contact. When you get the contacts, then, um, yeah, so I'll end the episode here. Thank you for watching.